Guys, this review will be spoiler free, along with every other review I'm making. And if it does happen to discuss spoilers from now on, I will be adding a spoiler alert before. But this one is not one of those videos. So, on to the review. Airplane is directed by Jim Abrahams, David Zucker, and Jerry Zucker. It focuses on a trans-American airline flight that loses both pilots and the navigator mid-air. Now, all the passengers must rely on Ted Stryker, a former Air Force pilot who can't cope with a failed attack that he commanded, as well as Elaine Dickinson, the stewardess on the flight who's also Ted's ex-girlfriend. Airplane brings us a lot of really funny jokes, the most iconic one probably being, Surely you can't be serious. I am serious, and don't call me Shirley. But my personal favorite is when Elaine is trying to hide from the passengers that both the pilots have passed out. And so she says, There's nothing to worry about. By the way, does anyone on board know how to fly a plane? Some of the really funny jokes are actually really raunchy too for a PG-rated movie, and I absolutely love it. They're hilarious. The raunchy jokes in here are pretty much everything that raunchy comedies we have nowadays aren't. The leading performances by Robert Hayes and Julia Haggerty are impressive. You see towards the beginning of the film that they've split up very recently. In fact, it's pretty close to before the film starts. And so this couple feels very lived in. The other lead performance by Leslie Nielsen as this doctor on board is absolutely hilarious and pretty much everything you'd want from a Leslie Nielsen performance. But there's one performance in here that clearly should have won an Oscar. Autopilot. <laughs> I'm so sorry. There are actually some great side character performances as well. Robert Stack as Rex Kramer was subtly funny, but oh my gosh, Peter Graves as Captain Clarence Over was literally the funniest performance in the entire movie. There's one scene where this kid, Joey, is in the cockpit with the pilots, and Captain Over says, Have you ever been in a cockpit before, Joey? No, sir, I've never even been in a plane. Well, Joey, have you ever seen a grown man naked? And it becomes this running joke that Captain Over will ask Joey such unusual questions. There are actually even some celebrity cameos, too. Ethel Merman plays a shell-shocked lieutenant who thinks he's Ethel Merman. And Kareem Abdul-Jabbar plays Roger Murdoch the co-pilot who is actually Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. And it's funny how they keep going back to that, especially with Joey in the cockpit mentioning every couple, every couple seconds, you're Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Now, although I've given Airplane a lot of praise in this review, there's still a few problems. Like, Airplane's story is unbelievably poorly written. It trades in a cohesive narrative for a series of scenes, each meant to lead up to a separate punchline. And because of this, the airplane feels like a film adaptation of a joke book. And this wouldn't be too much of a problem with if every joke was consistently funny, but some of them just come off as annoying. Like, there's a minor character named Johnny, and... Oh my gosh, I can't stand this character. So, some jokes are completely random. Like, for example, after the Does anyone on board know how to fly a plane gag, a woman is completely nude and runs right in front of the camera and just stands there for one whole second. I really have no idea what's happening in some of these scenes. I'm going to give Airplane a B+. Plus. It's not that I don't recommend seeing it, it's that you shouldn't expect Citizen Kane. And as for recommendations, I'm going to recommend 12 Angry Men due to its soul setting being very claustrophobic. Um, Zero Hour, because that's actually the movie that Airplane is parodying. And finally, Monty Python and the Holy Grail, because of its nonsensical humor, as well as its more masterful attempts at joke book storytelling. Well, sorry that review was kinda short. 
I wanted to get working on a special project I have coming up really soon after making this video. And so, thank you very much for sticking around. I hope you can stick around for the next one. Stay safe and watch good movies. Bye!